My work is the result of a long quest to find the essence and meaning to existence in this world and to find expressions of it through my art. My teachers at art school were for the most part abstract artists and I had a hard time with them as figurative paintings with philosophical and metaphysical themes were not tolerated at the time. I have always been interested in the techniques of the ancient masters of European art. Italian fresco painting techniques and allegories have had a major influence on my work. Mythology and symbology have become such a part of my paintings that if you were to take these parts away, it would be like cutting out the tongue and not being able to speak anymore. A major influence has been when I was working as a volunteer artist, part of a university's archaeological expedition in Greece. One day at the dig, I was drawing and measuring the stone walls of a tomb from the Roman era, which was open to the sky, and all of a sudden a jet fighter plane flew low in the sky over my head. As it created a shock with a roaring sound, I experienced a sort of spatial temporal boom in my mind, and suddenly I felt a strong synchronicity in time stretched out into the past and the future. I was inspired to look deeper into the nature and universality of human expression beyond culture and time. Also holding sculptures and objects made by the hand of artists thousands of years ago gave me a feeling of closeness to them. A sense of expanded timescapes has stayed with me since then. It has given me a sense of freedom to express myself with this memory in mind. I believe that human expression has to take history and evolution of cultures as its premise, a starting point to able one to speak to the present and future generations. An artist is like a radio receiver or satellite dish that makes received images visible, ones that appear in his or her mind from the collective awareness of humanity. Each artist just interprets these messages or images in their own personal way. As all artists work in the diverse and myriad ways, each way is valid and finds its particular or generic strata of community who appreciate its value. There is no monocultural mainstream in today's art world. All is valid if it's produced following the highest qualities of artistic integrity and, in, and technique. I believe it is necessary to look back at the past in order to understand the present and build a future.